So, welcome back to the channel, guys. If it's your first time, hello. Forced Awakenings. In December last year, uh, sorry, November last year, I was here, which is at a central house in Gradson Street in Darlington. And I bumped into a certain PCs, Sarah Bainbridge and PC Leslie. 1000 Bainbridge 2629 Leslie who accosted me told me that I couldn't film blah 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 the video is there if you wanted um, and now we're back today Monday the 3rd of August gorgeous day plenty of time to see the architecture that we were talking about the last one and a chance to really try out this new gimbal that I've got for my phone a um, little bit of a breeze so just an update on what happened with PC Bainbridge and Leslie um, made a complaint it went as far as Inspector Knox at Darlington Police who I went in to see um, I did record the interview even though he said at the time that he didn't want it recording, I still recorded it anyway um, but there's no video for that, it's just audio um, so this is the main building um, yeah so anyway I went in to see him um, and basically he fobbed me off back to his offices most of the way um, he did say that they would be doing some training over um, sort of data protection and um, dealing with photographers whether they did or not I don't know I didn't take it any further I wasn't after them for money um, it's not why I do this it's just to show them as the bullies that they were and hopefully they'll learn the lesson so that's that so we're back here today So we've got a new gimbal. I've already been spotted by police there. Um, and they're probably going to pull in here. Yeah, here we go. Um, I'll get accosted by these ones now. So that was that was more or less the end of it. Um, I'm really just sort of spoken to any officers since um, I did have a run in with one about parking um, I don't know whether I'm going to post that one yet um, but if I do I do we'll see what happens with that later um, I'm not quite sure yet but so that was that so like I say that was November last year um, And I'm not sure if, like I say, that training went ahead. What was interesting is that PC Bainbridge was later, um, the, sorry, the next month, shown on the cover of the local Darlington magazine. The, don't cry, got the PCSOs. Oops. Um, What's wrong with our gimbal here? It's gone all weird. Where are you going? Sort yourself out. No, not having it. Still getting used to this thing. Try turning on, man. I think the battery's flat, great. That's, good. that's what happens when you don't charge things up. Um, yeah, so that's what happened with that. Um, at the time, I was filming the building there, and this one here, um, PC Bainbridge came and said I was filming those things, the security cameras, which I am today, because fuck her. Um, but I wasn't, you can quite clearly see on the video 
I pretend that I wasn't. Um, and she was not happy, one butt hurt PC. It's Youth Offending Service here as well, Drug and Alcohol Action Team. The building's phenomenal, isn't it? The, it was an old school, Central School in Darlington. Um, if you look closely on that previous video, you can actually see um, as I walk along this stretch, as I'm doing now, PC Rembridge is actually sat in a van. So sort of, I think it was behind where that car is there, where that police car is. Um, and she saw me from there. There was a lady stood over here um, who approached her. Um, just kind of caught that out of the corner of my eye. I didn't pay much attention at the time. 1910, this was built. It was a boys, separate boys and separate girls school. Um, Obviously, that bit was added later. This backs onto a park just over there. The sun's gorgeous, isn't it? I don't know if you can see actually there. No, I don't suppose that fucking helps actually. <laughs> I will also run the civic enforcement, which is the council stewards and people like that here. Where you're going, you're pulling into there. Um, yeah, so yeah, that was it. So I just wanted to give you guys all a sort of a brief update on, on how that went. Um, and like I say, the hopefully that message has been passed on. I would like to think so. taking his new power drill to work. That's that. It would appear so. And I'm quite glad that that's the case. And hopefully we won't see any more repercussions, or any more further instances. Um, of what we saw on that video so thanks for watching guys stay tuned force awakenings out <laughs>